there's always two sides to a story, but I can only give you my story. Now this is all about All-Star Weekend. This is all about me having a breakout season as a rookie. Now I thought I wouldn't experience anything like this, but I've had homies switch up on me. I have fans turning backs on me. But recently with me getting selected into the All-Star game, everybody's coming out the woodworks. Even the thoughts. This is where the story starts. All-Star rosters have been announced. Here's what DJ had to say about being named to the team. It's an amazing feeling. I mean, playing in an All-Star game was my goal from the very beginning, ever since I took my first shot in the NBA. And I didn't think it would happen this fast, so I definitely have to thank my fans and my teammates for, for helping me accomplish this in my rookie season. I mean, and to think, a year ago, I was just mixing beats and just doing my own thing. And I mean, now... I'm getting ready to play with some of the best players in the world. Can't wait. And it's funny to hear DJ talk about... One of those days, sir. One of those days, Spinelli. Chin up. You'll get him next time. You want to know the most stressful thing, man? Trying to please the endorsement companies. Not even sure if they're actually voiding your contract by playing games for these companies. Now, I just want to come home, kick my feet up. And who do I see in my crib, man? Be Fresh and her little improv group. But man, before I could even really snap on them, I seen... What are you guys doing in my house? Her. What a beauty. Who's that? That's the only thing that's going through my mind. Like, where'd she come from? Soaking wet. Shake it like a salt shake. 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 Cut it, cut it, cut it. All right, bring my slow music back in, man. So I had a conversation with this young lady. Now, I actually didn't catch her name because I was kind of, you know, spun up into the conversation. But she was telling me how she's one of B-Fresh's closest friends. She doesn't really talk much, but when she does, she says the right thing. Now, she was the only person to come to my court, ball out with me on the basketball court while everybody else sat on the sideline i guess everybody didn't want to cock block too much so they just let me and her have a little bit of one-on-one -on -one time if you know what i mean now me and her was just putting up a couple shots and i ain't gonna lie man she a little nice man she a little bit better than some of these my player people man i don't know she might be able to drop you off at the park but that's here nor there now after balling on the court man we decided to take a little bit of one-on-one -on -one time on the couch now you know how chicks do right if they trying to get with you or they trying to find out what you really about, they go for your phone. Now, she pulled my phone out of my hand, man, and I'm just sitting there like, bruh, what is she going to find? You know, she was scrolling through my Instagram, scrolling through my photos, checking my likes, see who I'm tweeting, checking my DM. And guess what she finds, man? She found out that I'm going to be an all-star this year. This totally turned me off, man. Not another one. Man, she ain't nothing but a thought, bro. Now, I know you guys think my day can't get any worse, but they called it an emergency team practice. And guess who I ran into as soon as I got there? What up, Shan? What's up, All-Star? Oh, man, come on, not you too, bro. What? I'm tired of people going around saying the same thing to me. Is it even that big of a deal? Is it a big deal? Are you serious? I man, some people go their whole entire career not making it in, and you made it in the first year. Don't be a dumb. A dummy. Okay, so is that what this is about? You're just mad it's not you? What? I'm not mad at all. I was actually giving you a compliment. Now, you want to take shots or you going to accept that compliment like a real man? I'm sorry, Shane. It's just, I'm tired of people treating me different. I'm regular DJ. All right, yeah, but this is what comes with the turf, man. You just got to accept it. I guess you're right. Look, I'm sorry about what I said. Hey, man, no apologies. It's all good, all right? We on the same team. Never forget that. All right, I bet. Thanks, Shane. I'll catch up with you later. Now, this is one of those moments where I would just shake things off. But lately, man, me and Shammy just haven't been seeing eye to eye. And right here, guys, with this little screenshot, you can see the envy in his eyes. The hate in his heart for me. I came in, he called me his rookie, and I'm outshining this dude. And no, it ain't rubbing off on him at all. But he gonna respect me. Wait till I catch up with him, yo. Alright guys, we've been through potential groupies slash thotties, the envious teammates, but we got one more act left, man. It's game day. I ain't got too much on my mind, but guess who I ran into, man? 
a beloved fan. What up, little Jug? What's up, DJ? Hey, hey, DJ. So, I had a favor to ask you. <sighs> what now, man? Look, there are no more old records, man, that I had cleared me out. No, nah, no, nah, I had something else in mind, man. Like what? Well, it's just that I've never been, right? And it's always been a dream of mine to go, but, well, it's just that... Spit it out, man. The All-Star Game, man. I heard you got picked. You're funny, bro. What up, boo-boo? Hey, what's up? What up, Shan? What's happening, bro? Dude wants to go to the All-Star Game. Of course, you all week. Look, man, I can't just let you go to the All-Star Game for nothing. You gotta deserve it, Jug. You gotta earn it. You doing good in school? You staying out of trouble? No. Yes, sir. All right, well, look. Did you just call me sir? Now you want to call me sir today? You usually roast me, bro. You don't want to roast me today? No, sir. <laughs> Look, man, you funny. All right, if you can prove to me that you're doing a good job in school, respecting your teachers, you know, paying attention in class, I'll send you to the All-Star. Really? Yes. Like, for real, for real? I can go? You can go, but that depends on what your teachers say. So you need to show me no, something. No, 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 right? I know, I know. I've been good, though. Yeah? I'll send you a note. Well, you better send me a note, but it better not be in your handwriting, okay? <laughs> DJ, I would never. All right, man. I'm going to see you. Study those books. Now, that was expected, seeing as though a fan became somewhat of a friend. But you always know, man, you got to keep people on the right track. You can't just be giving things out to people without them giving you something in return. And I told Jug, make sure you stay in school. Make sure you keep them grades right. And I encourage anybody watching this video to do the same. This is your boy, IKC, signing out. Hope you guys enjoyed this storyline video. And I'm going to see you guys in the next one. Peace.